What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Gunfish TV. I want to thank you for tuning in to my channel today. I appreciate it very much. As you can see right here behind me, I've got the kayak out here today. Now, I have not kayak fished in quite a while. If you've watched my channel for a pretty good long time, you'll know that I did do some kayak videos kind of in the beginning, but I got away from it a little bit. I don't know really why. Um, just did a lot of boat fishing, but you know, when I was growing up, I did a lot of kayak fishing. Me and my dad, we would fish the rivers and we would take these things all over the place. You know, this is just an ocean kayak, Malibu 2. It's not a super expensive setup like a lot of people have now, but you know, this will get the job done. I've caught some absolute giants out of this kayak. As a matter of fact, other than the 12 pounder I caught earlier this year, two of the biggest bass I'd ever caught in my life, I'd actually caught out of this kayak. So very excited to get out on the water today. We're gonna do some frogging, and we're gonna do some top water stuff, maybe a floating worm. Did bring a Texas rig with me in case things are slow, but I really, really doubt that. The river is absolutely perfect right now. It's a beautiful day, it's Labor Day right now, and usually this time of year, the fish absolutely chew. So we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna slide this kayak down in the water, get it organized, and we're gonna get to fishing. I think we are gonna have an awesome day. All righty, let's see, I think we got everything ready to go got me a brand new seat in here way more comfortable than the other ones we used to have which back in the day they were they were nice but they make a lot a lot nicer stuff now but let's take this bad boy and slide it in and man let me tell you i am just so excited if i can do this without flipping my kayak there we go all right Ugh. Down the steps we go. Oh man, this is gonna be so fun. These rod tie downs are, and uh, rod and gear wraps, they're really handy. I make them in a whole bunch of different colors, you know, on the website, but really nice to keep your rods together and organized. Man, the river looks perfect. I mean, look how low it is. Hopefully these giants will be up just wanting to crush the frog. I mean, if it goes down like I think it can, we could have an amazing day. All right, let's get these unstrapped. Simple to do. Just pull down, adjust, and pop them off. Bam. All right. And I'll get these a little bit more organized once we get in the boat. All right, so let's see if we can do this without falling in. This might be a disaster. Oh no, we got her. We got her. Just gotta get our weight balanced and we are in. We are in. All right, so we gotta get these rods organized just a touch better. I'm gonna try to get this camera angled right i was actually going to run a camera up on the front but my mount on the front is so old it was for an older uh camera and not for a not for a gopro so it didn't uh it didn't mount up right but it's all good it is all good hopefully i got this camera good because i think we are gonna have an insane day Got the old Booyah pad crasher right there. Got the little legs on the bottom. Just throwing it on a Revo X and got the uh, carbon fire, loose carbon fire speed sticking at 7.2 medium heavy. Absolutely love this rod for the frog. Just went and bought another one because I liked it so dang much. But we are off. I mean, this is the first time and first time in years it's pretty cool one thing about kayak fishing is a lot of times you get bites and you're kind of not in position especially with me sitting so low you know i'm not in a not in a new kayak so my body position isn't exactly right sometimes but i think we are gonna absolutely crush them Definitely have potential to catch a mega donkey as well. 
să se wingero. So just to give y'all an idea what time we started here. So we started, it's, it's 11.04 right now. So we started a little bit later than what I wanted to. Uh, me and my wife got to watching Stranger Things last night. And some of y'all that watch my channel might watch Stranger Things on Netflix, but uh, we had never watched it before and we just got into watching and we ended up watching it till like one o'clock last night. So uh, was up a little bit late, but we're out here now and I think we're gonna have a awesome day. Gonna have a good day regardless. Oh, I can't believe it. Oh, the frog got hung. That doesn't happen too often. Not in wood anyway. Huh, didn't want to get hung there. That's a good spot. Must have got wedged. But I think we've got a good, a good day. And regardless, you know, even if we don't absolutely destroy the fish, which I think we are, but um, if we don't, you know, we'll still have a beautiful day of scenery out here on the river. I'm going to go come up here and see if I see any fish. Let's get the old... Let's get the old rage bug out through that. Throw that up here. Oh, there's one. Got it. Oh God, that was a nice one. Oh my, that was a nice fish. Okay, let's back up a little bit. Real sure why he come off. That was a good one. There's one. Got it. <laughs> there we go. Dude, it, it might be a flipping bite. It might be a flipping bite on today. I don't want to crowd that that point right there because that's the second bite I've had on it. Pretty little guy. There we go. Pretty little dude on the rage bug. Thank you, bud. Give myself a little bit of line. You know, it could definitely be a flipping bite. Today, things are like really calm right now. No wind, like whatsoever. Um, so it, it definitely could be a flipping bite. But we're gonna, we're gonna retie. That fish was up in some stuff and he just frayed my line. So we're gonna retie real quick and get back up there. This is just a good old blue crawl rage bug with a 3 8 ounce, one objective tungsten on here and just a three alt owner hook and i'm throwing that on 20 pound test p line and hopefully we catch a whole bunch of fish i really want to catch them on top water on the frog but you know if i have to have to do this i will definitely do this too it's going to be no complaints from me if I got to catch them on a soft plastic. And what little bit I've thrown it, it definitely seems like they're on it because I have not thrown it hardly any. Once we get down in the faster stuff, that frog might, might uh, do a little bit better, but. Oh my goodness, bass just blew up behind us. This is all new stuff. You know, this is, this is new. This was not here last year. Oh, there's one. Mm, that's a good one. Oh, yeah. That is a nice one. That is a nice one there. <laughs> that is cool. Come here, bud. Oh, yeah, that is a thick, chunky one. I got to give myself more line. I haven't I haven't fished in a kayak in quite a while, so y'all gotta apologize. I got, I y'all gotta, I gotta apologize because I don't have my stuff together. But 
Mm, I mean, he absolutely choked that rage bug. Right up there by that treetop. There we go. What a chunk. That is a beauty right there. That is a beauty. I've got sweat dripping down my face. It wasn't even supposed to be that hot today. And uh, it's just humid. It's just that time of year when it's just really humid. We're going to take a quick picture of this guy. Pretty one. Pretty guy. All right. Oh, he's going to do it. That's just as cool as it gets. That is just as cool as it gets. All right. Let's get us another one. Ah, I'm going to stick the hook in my leg. Oh, this is just going to be an amazing day. That fish come off the bank and ate it. Oh, that was so cool. That fish was so shallow. Oh, I think he had another one with him. Oh yeah, he's got another one with him. Oh, let's see if we can catch that one. Wouldn't this be cool? Oh no, I missed him. Oh my God. Oh, I missed him. As soon as it hit the water, he ate it. That was cool. And this time of year, they will do that in the river. Okay, I missed that one. That would have been awesome. I thought I saw another one underneath of it. It's a solid little chunky fish. Right there, choked that frog. Oh man, we almost doubled up in the kayak. That would have been absolutely awesome. Thank you, buddy. I mean, they come off right here beside me out of this wood. He's going right back to where, I mean, right back to where he was sitting at. That was awesome. Man, I could have doubled up. Hell, that would have been so cool. That would have been so cool. As soon as I dropped it in there, that fish just came up and ate it. All right, let's get our stuff kind of back organized. That was a little bit of chaos right there. Oh, he come up and ate it so soft, I won't even look him. I won't even pay any attention, and he come up and got it. Oh, there we go. Pretty dude. Pretty fish. I mean, he just come up and slurped it. Didn't even hardly make a noise. Beautiful. Thank you, bud. The old Booyah Aqua Frog. Straight killer, I mean. All right, let's try. Let's try the old Rage Bug right here. We've got a lot deeper water. Definitely makes sense for the Rage Bug to work a little better here. Starting to be a lot of activity all of a sudden where it wasn't much activity at all. And now it's it's fish jumping everywhere. So maybe, maybe things are starting to get fired up a little bit. I know a bunch of them are probably blackfish and gore, but still most of the time when they're coming up and they're active, most of the time that translates into bass. That was a good bite. Oh no, he's got it. Oh, there we go. Come here, bud. Little guy. Right there on that little piece of wood. Fish number five. So that's fish number five. I brought it off that piece of wood right here. And he thumped it. I felt him thump it. Thought maybe it was a, maybe it was a good one, but it was a little squeaker. That's okay. He counts. He definitely counts. All right. <laughs> that 
was cool. Oh, there's another one with, oh my. Oh, I just had two on the frog at one time. Are you kidding me? I literally just had two on the frog at one time. That is insane. And, and I think y'all can see how I almost had that he's gonna come off. Oh, he didn't. But look how my hook, look how my hooks are hanging out. Oh my goodness, I just had two on at the frog at one time. That is insane. That is a fatty right there. Pretty one. Thank you, bud. You know, I'm going to change colors and I'm going to do it just based off of the fact that I'm not destroying them. I mean, I am catching fish, but I'm not just absolutely whacking them. So we're going to change up to the uh, sunburn color. And we're going to do that because, oh, you know what? We might could go with this little bit smaller profile. Hmm, I tell you what, let's do that. Forgot I got that little guy. That's a popping pad crasher junior. You know, they're just not absolutely eaten, so they might, might be on this a little bit. So let's get this guy prepped up. Might be a little bit harder to cast, but might be able to do something with it. All right, we're all rigged up with the little, with the little mini frog. That's the Booyah Pop and Pray Crasher Jr. I don't cast quite as good. Which I knew it wouldn't. I mean, it's not as heavy. But that bad boy might get some bites that the big one wouldn't get. Cause like I said, the fish are being just a little bit funny. So maybe they'll smoke this thing. Got smaller hooks on it, of course. Oh, that's one. I mean, he come up and just slurp that thing. All right, second cast with it. Second cast. Oh, I think that's number 12. Okay, okay, okay. I'll take that. Come off that piece of wood and just choked it. And one thing I like about this little this little junior is it, I mean, it walks good. This is my first time throwing it. I hadn't thrown it before. Oh man, that thing walks good. That's a good one. Oh yeah. Biggest in a day. I mean, just choke that thing. Come here, come right in front. Ooh, nice one. Yep. Good fish. Just absolutely choke that thing. There we go. I mean, look at that. Gone. Absolutely gone. That's how you want them to eat it. Pretty fish. Thank you, buddy. There we go. I mean, they are, they are chomping this little frog, y'all. They are really eating it good. Definitely better than they were the bigger frog. Now, I don't know if it's the color or if it's the, you know, just the size. I don't know, but the change was definitely a good idea. I can tell you that. I'd, ooh, just got another bite. I think that was a brown though. I'd kind of forgot that I threw them in my bag. To be honest with you. I went fishing with my buddy, smallmouth fishing. And I took them with me just, just because. 
glad I left them in there. They're coming up and just slurping it so silently. I mean, just so silently. It's pretty crazy. Yeah, come here. There he is. Oh, I think that's number 15. There you go, bud. I mean, I just looked and I was like, where's my frog? I mean, it's pretty crazy. There we go. I want to keep from going up there though because that's a good spot right there. All right, come here, bud. I think that's number 18, I believe. Pretty little fish. Thank you. Oh, that's a good one. If I can get him over the log. Oh, don't come off. That is a good one. Probably the biggest of the day, I would say. I don't know if y'all could see. Oh, yeah, here we go. We got him over. We got him over. Yeah. There we go. That's a solid one. Oh, my wrinkle's all in the water. Falling down. That's a pretty little dude right there. Oh my goodness, I've got to I've got to give myself some one on here. I've got a mess. What are we doing here? What are we doing? Oh my god. I mean this is is, is this not amateur hour? This is like amateur hour, y'all. Whew. Hadn't fished out of a kayak in a while, so I'm I'm trying to trying to get everything back right it's a lot different than fishing out of the old ranger i can tell you that or even out of the alumacraft i mean that little frog it's a pretty little bass right there that little frog is catching them thank you there buddy there he goes all right i mean this frog is getting trashed i don't know if y'all can see i mean the color on this thing is gone i think that was number 19 i think that was number 19 and i've like got a lot more bites on this frog and and missed some as well but lens looks good wanted to make sure it won't won't uh full of water spots but this little frog is getting smoked Okay, well, we're gonna tie on the mini of the aqua frog just because we're changing it up we're gonna do that and see if that makes any difference Did y'all see that? Did y'all see that? That was insane. That was insane. I don't know if y'all could see that on the GoPro or not. That fish hit it right beside the boat, and it is a nice one. Oh, he just come off. No. It was like a four, four and a half pounder. He hit it right beside the boat. What the heck? Oh, no. That was so so freaking cool that was awesome doggone it what is up with me not being able to put a good fish in the boat it's crazy that was insane 
that was an insane bite that fish come i mean oh i hate i lost him but hopefully y'all can see that bite on the gopro because that was nuts that was a god he blew it so hard Oh, giant. Oh my God, giant. If I get this one in, this will be a miracle. All over logs and everything. I saw him come and eat it. Don't come off, please. Don't come off. I'm all in the trees here. Oh. Got him. Yes. <laughs> got that sucker i mean you talk about choking it absolutely choked that is a pretty one it is about time i saw him come off that log and eat it pretty one that fish there is probably four pounds that's a nice fish nice fish oh, pretty thank you bud we're gonna get a picture of him real quick awesome i drug that fish over all kinds of logs and stuff i mean just goes to show you that if you're meant to catch them you will let's see if this dude will dance for us i don't think he wants to nah he said i ain't dancing so i'm ready to get back down there to my log nice i mean i don't know how in the world i caught him drug him over every doggone limb there and log there is <laughs> just goes to show you i mean the other fish that i had on was just as big as that i mean easily just as big as that makes me wonder now if maybe when i changed colors if i should have just went stuck with this color with the aqua frog but just went to the smaller profile i don't know That's a pretty good one. Yep. They are just giving me a face full. Oh, he's done gotten hung. There we go. We got him out. This is a nice fish. He's actually a little bit better. Oh, yeah. He's better than what I thought he was. Come here. This is another doggone good one. Come here. Yeah. There we go. Another good fish. Solid one. Three pounder. Yes, sir. We are doing something now. Thank you, bud. You gonna go? I don't think he's gonna let go of my finger. There you go, buddy. It's crazy. Right as I was letting him go, I don't know. Y'all probably can't see it on the GoPro, but it's so many bait fish right here they're just sitting along in this current break right in this little seam and they are just by the thousands bait fish it's just crazy i think this color is calling up the better fish i'm going to be honest with you just the last three fish that i've caught on this have been much better quality fish than what i was catching on that that uh sunfish color or the pumpkin seed color so the problem is I only have one. I have another pumpkin seed one, but I only have this small aqua frog. So need to try to salvage this one as absolutely much as possible. My other one, my weight fell out of it. That's why, that's why I had to take that one off. But the bigger fish definitely seem to be biting this one better nice all right let's get back in action here get the old kayak back ready to go and i'm gonna tell you what i'm very impressed with this seat right here i ordered it off amazon it was like i don't know 
39 dollars 40 bucks something but man that thing has saved my butt it is so much better than the ones that we used to use Phew, the ones we used to use were terrible I'm not gonna lie they would they would hurt your butt big time but here we go got the old hey dude soaking wet they are good water shoes i'm not gonna lie let's see if we can get a giant on the old frog we're throwing the little dude and this may not last throughout the day which with it getting cloudy like it is you know they might just smash the big one to be honest with you they might like have done turned on to it but we're gonna keep throwing this for now because we're getting bit by big fish on it so there's no need to change I think this is a great bit. Oh, it's a nice one. As soon as it hit the water, he smoked it. I mean, absolutely smoked it. Chunk. And I, I apologize for the noise in the background. It's a, a farmer has his uh, pump running. But, oh man, I mean, double roofed him. Pretty dude man so much fun so much fun watch that dude swim away i don't well i was gonna watch him swim away i don't even know where he went he went hauling tail that's where he went oh there he is he just he just come out from under the kayak he didn't know where he was supposed to go so that was 22. 22. Oh, giant. Giant. Yep, this is a giant. Oh, please don't come off. Oh, this is a giant. Oh, God. Oh, don't come off. Oh, he's not hooked good. I got to get him up here to me don't come off this is the one this is the one y'all but i got i gotta get him come here come here come here yes yes baby absolute tank freaking tank right there look i did not have him good oh man that is a tank I don't know how much that fish right there weighs. I don't know. That is a pretty one though. Right here by this log. I mean, an absolute chunk. All right, y'all. That dude right there is a tank. Beautiful fish. Beautiful fish. Let that dude go. I mean, look at that thing. Man, that's a nice fish. There she goes. Yes, we finally caught a big one in the boat. In the kayak, I should say. Man, I was starting to have my doubts because I knew he won't hook good and he kept jumping. I could not get him to us. That is awesome. Thank you. Phew, finally, y'all. He come up and bit it and I was like, oh, that is a big one. There we go. There we go. On the rage bug. Number 25. 
number 25 right there it's a little dude it is a little guy but look 25 right there that's going to end this video i'm going to let that little dude go he just splashes he uh splashed the camera too all right wipe that off so look should have some good stuff coming in this next video i'm telling y'all this is this is going to be awesome i think this second part is going to be epic i really do so i'm gonna go ahead we're gonna get back moving down this river i'm gonna pick that frog back up hopefully we catch a giant i really really appreciate y'all watching really really appreciate it more than more than y'all know and uh be sure to go check out my new website gfoutdoors.com and check my stuff out i appreciate it i really do let's go ahead let's get number 26 on to maybe 50 in the boat let's see if we can get 50 i'll see y'all next time i'll see y'all on the next video